All right, we are up here in Heber City, Utah, on an account that we ran two nights ago, and the vehicle wasn't showing up at the given address, and it looked like they were moving out, or in the process of moving out. And so uh, we did some research, and we found out that they split up, and she's moved out, is living in an apartment. Uh, we got the name of the apartment complex, and the vehicle has not shown up there, but we also knew that she was working at an insurance agency somewhere <coughs> right off Main Street in uh, Heber. And so we just Googled the whole list of all the insurance agencies. There's only six. And I'm on the second one right now, and I just found the vehicle in a parking lot here. So I'm going to grab my GPS device that I have stuck on the side of my bike here. And that's our vehicle right there, the black Passat. And the insurance place that she works at is right over there. So what we want to do is we want to try to get it up on the vehicle without being seen. Do a walk by, see what the scenario looks like. From what we understand, the insurance company's upstairs, and there are windows up there. So we want to make sure that if she has a view out the window to her car, she doesn't see us. Put this device on there. I think I'm going to come up from this side and just lay down and slap it right up underneath the back side of it. That'd be my best angle. bike and kind of hang out for a second and make sure nobody comes out asking any questions or anything. We'll just kind of scope the scene and then once we know we're clean, we'll uh, head back down the canyon, get the truck. One of the reasons I brought the bike up today was because I wasn't sure I was going to be doing research and investigation and so it's a fun ride to go up the canyon, you know, so I like to take the bike out when I can and save on fuel and uh, in this case, it turned out to be a good ride, so when we get back on this uh, video, we should be uh, pulling up here with the truck. Get everything booted up here. Laptop going. Go get us a repo. All right, we're just coming up on the uh, address here where we left the vehicle, the GPS device on it. And I did a ping on it one more time on the laptop just to make sure it's still sitting there in the parking lot, and it is. <clears throat> so we're going to get pulled over here. I'm going to jump out and get the lift ready we'll get backed up to this thing and get it picked up and then we'll make contact with her and get some keys from her and let her get some property out before we uh, head back down the mountain because this is a good you know 15 20 minutes away from Orem so uh, looks like she left and then came back the vehicle's now turned around did have access to the front of it before and now we don't. Crap. So I'm gonna have to put the go jacks on it. 
push it out. Do you have a number to get a hold of them, or do you want to just call him and have him call them? Um, he can call me. I'm not going to. Okay, you got what you need out of the vehicle? Uh -huh. you have a key we can keep with it? <clears throat> There's a key in there. There is? In the ignition. Oh, you left it in the ignition? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, thank you. Check the ignition first, but I had to bring that flip flop back up to her. She dropped it while getting her stuff out, so I brought the flip flop back into her. Check the ignition, make sure there's a key in there. She's pretty upset about the whole situation, as is most people are. But what can you do? Key in here, I don't see one. Make sure she didn't accidentally drop it in the stuff out. Sometimes people do that. They'll get stuff out of the trunk and then they'll accidentally pack the key away. Yeah. 
So, and then back up one more time. Ask for the key politely. Maybe she's found it by now. Sometimes this job's a process. <laughs> Actually, most of the time this job's a process. Just stick with the process and things go good. in the door she was gone and a pile of stuff that she took out of the vehicle was sitting there on the seat and that was sitting in the pile right on top she didn't even know it was there she thought she left it in the car that's a uh, part of doing this job for a billion years you get to where you can think of things that people just don't think of because you've seen it happen enough times that you, you know where that key went so get some lights put on this and Head for the freeway. <laughs> <laughs> 